тронтесь, вы смотрите, не обсуждайте, что можно, говорите, если вдруг пойдет не туда. А, а да, надо брать. Так, его ставить головой туда. То есть я скажу, да. Так, Лёг, за переклад. Она не настолько тяжелая, как она. Да. Так, куда забудем? Так, так, только, только вот это сюда. Смотри. Да, голову сюда на меня. Осторожно, там знаки. Ничего не надо говорить, надо просто ставить на эти стойки. Children that were from the Ukraine that were taken hostage, and I hope there will be also other. Друзья, я хочу спросить вас, кто такой Путин? Вы сказали очень много слов, но я не слышал ни одного слова, кто бы сказал: Путин мой президент. Путин не президент. Путин убийца. Путин убийца. Путин убийца. Путин убийца. Turkey's fifth-generation KAAN fighter has successfully completed its second test flight. The technical details of the tests have not yet been announced. The flight has not been officially confirmed yet. Since the first flight on February 21st, engineers have been integrating new systems to improve the fighter's software, flight, and combat characteristics, TGRT TV channel said. It should be noted that on February 21st, The KAN fighter jet of the Turkish Air Force, which took off from the murdered airbase in Ankara, stayed in the air for 13 minutes, the speed was more than 420 km per hour, and the flight height was 2.4 km. The Turkish aerospace industry considers the assembly of the second prototype as a pivotal milestone in the aircraft's ongoing evolution. The impending comprehensive flight tests will not only ask questions but will also provide vital responses. In any such project, The development and testing of a second prototype is always marked as a crucial turning point. In the first stage of the Khan's airborne trials, the team will meticulously assess the aircraft's flightworthiness. This involves judgments on the aircraft's maneuverability, stability, and control across various altitudes and speeds, ensuring its performance aligns with expectations. Analysts project that the TAIKAN will host an array of weapons, a mix of air-to-air, -air, air-to-surface, and anti-ship missiles. Additionally, there is the possibility that developers might include an internal gun. Yeah, the long sister.